To try out Google's new body browser application, what you'll need to do is search for body browser in Google and click on Google body. And you come up with a screen. What you'll need is to get one of these browsers, Google Chrome beta, Mozilla Firefox 4 beta, WebKit. Uh, I downloaded Google Chrome Beta. Here I have pulled up the Chrome browser and once you get this installed just type in Google Body Browser click on Google body. First thing you'll see is the person in the middle and the controls on the left side. The default setting is to let you scroll through the layers of the body starting with the skin at the top, moving through muscle, bone, organs, circulatory system, and nervous system fade these in and out. I prefer this way, which is another way of viewing the systems in an isolated way. So if you know you just want to look at bone, you can fade everything else out like this with these individual sliders until all that's left is just the bone. So I'm leaving the bone slider alone here. You have several controls available. The top is just the directional control, um, going up and down, panning up and down. These side controls control the rotation. You can also use your mouse to click and drag to have a little bit better and finer control. You click and drag up and down to scroll up and down, and then you can use your scroll wheel on your mouse if your mouse has one to zoom in and out. Unfortunately, the program doesn't allow you to pan left and right, which seems a little ridiculous. I'm not sure why they didn't include that. And so I can't move the focus of this window over to where the hand is in the middle, which is a little strange. So if I want to take a close-up view of something in the hand, it, it superimposes everything uh, on top of each other, which is a little difficult. So it's easier to look uh, right at the rib or spine uh, close up than it is to look at something at the periphery of the body like the hand. Each body part is labeled. You can click on something you want to know the name of. Uh, whatever body system it is, whether it's a muscle or a bone. Here we have the pectoralis muscle.